The, the Nintendo Switch is getting an officially licensed Mario Kart racing wheel. This is from Ryan Craddock over at Nintendo Life. It says, um, gaming accessory maker Hori is set to release a Mario Kart racing wheel for Nintendo Switch. It has been revealed. Two different versions of the wheel will be available, one being described as a standard model and the other being a more expensive deluxe model. The accessory will reportedly be compatible with both Nintendo Switch and PC, with functions from uh, Switch's Joy-Cons and Pro Controller being available as standard. It also comes with a foot pedal, as you can see in the images below. So here's like the basic version of it. Um, and this, uh, oh, well, why wouldn't you have it ordered the way it's laid out here? Come on, Nintendo life. The, this, this looks like it would fall apart. <laughs> be honest with you. I, I feel like I would tear this up. Um, so you've got this one. Uh, it looks like this one has bat, uh, uh, you know, paddles on the back here. Is the drift a feature or a bug? So, so this one is like the beefy boy. Um, you can set up custom dead zones in this one. I, I think this may have some force feedback. Did I see that earlier? Dead zone adjustment and reality adjustment uh, options to alter the wheels turning radius. Um, it also works in docked mode, although an extra USB accessory will uh, reportedly enable the wheel to be used with switch light. And the uh, deluxe edition comes with some welcome extra uh, extras like suction cups so you can attach it to your desk. I've got a racing wheel that I played like Forza Horizon 3 with. I, I like the idea of a racing wheel until you get to a racing wheel, like get to using a racing wheel and you're like, eh, I drive a car all the time. And this doesn't feel like driving a car. Oh, <laughs> is the drift a bug or a feature on the Switch Lite? In Mario Kart, it, it can be used to your advantage. Everywhere else, you're going to have to send it in in three months to get it replaced with a, another Switch Lite. Um, so pre-orders are up, uh, or, or at least in play Asia, this retails for 137, um, Amazon, let's see, 60 fake dollars for that. So I, I, I like racing wheels in concept, in concept. And I think it also comes down to just buying a nice one too, with like force feedback, which n neither of these have, it doesn't seem, but, um, with like force feedback, weighted pedals, all that kind of stuff. Roy Speedrun says, I just want a new burnout game. Dude, I miss the old Need for Speeds. And I know that they've tried to capture some of the Need for Speed stuff. I really enjoy If you haven't played the Forza Horizon games, I would totally recommend them. They are a blast. They are a lot of fun. A lot of different cars. Really great. Um really great worlds that are built. The races are pretty fun, but just the open world driving in those games are fantastic. Fantastic. Highly recommend. So yeah, um, they updated this to say great news, folks. The Mario Kart racing wheel has now been spotted in the West with a pre-order option appearing on Amazon UK. Um, and again, set for 60 fake dollars. So, and an estimated release date of the 3rd of January, 2020, which is January 3rd, 2020 for all of us normals. So, Oh, yeah, but uh, all of those are on Game Pass, dude. Definitely try it. Definitely try it. 